Happy Road everywhere. It's me again. Um, I did ask Fiat to come with me. Apparently, I'm nuts. So I come for, come down the river and have a dip, have a splash about, have a little swim. Um, sorts the head. I'm going to try and do it every day, except when nature makes it impossible, such as flood and the like. Uh, and what I'm going to do, all the videos that I'm doing, I'm going to put on my website with all the other stuff that I post regarding mental health, um, from contrast showers to meditation to nature in the outdoors, um, coping strategies for anxiety, panic, all of that sort of stuff. So rather than it be all over the place, uh, I'll put it all, I'll embed the videos into my website and, and then I'll share it onto the, the book of face so people can share it and everything. People say when you when you're going into cold water and it's it's not overly cold, that you should get in nice and gently, take it easy, sort of acclimatise yourself. Just watching a swan drift off down there. No one else about. So um But I I, I don't do that. I, I think there's only one way to get into the water and you just go And you do it like that, and then you're in. I understand. I I mean, I do um, contrast showers, cold showers. I come in the river quite often, so I am more acclimatised to it. And you've got to give it respect. You've got to give give water, whatever time of the year, give it respect. Um, here, it's not too bad. It's not overly deep, and it's only up to my chest here. Places like reservoirs, lakes, like that, that the water's so deep it never ever warms and 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 that's where these, these poor kids are drowning and everything and have you know untimely deaths. It's it's really down, down to cold shock. They go in and the shock puts their bodies into into, into shock and their internal organisms start shutting down and everything and then they can't swim so they can't get out. And they drown, so you've got to give it respect. Um, people wear wetsuits. Later on in the year, I'll wear a wetsuit. But um, a wetsuit's not a dry suit. It doesn't keep you warm, etc. It just takes away that initial shock and everything. So, here I am again. Just floating about. Sorting the head out. Cold water therapy. Um, it's got so many benefits. They are all on, on the, the website. When I put the videos up, I'll put a link to the benefits of cold water therapy. And I'll also be in amongst nature. You know, trees, birds, fish. Um, apparently there are a pair of otters along this stretch. I haven't seen them. I've seen the mink that are along here. Um, all manner of birds, wildfowl, all different kinds of ducks, geese. And then all, your, your, all the others, you know, your, your blue tits, your great tits, coal tits, yellow wagtails, pied wagtails, finches. So, I'm going to say goodbye. I'm going to have a swim, have a paddle about. Saturday, the tinkers at home. I did ask her, and she said, "Not a chance." I said, "It's, it's nice." I said, "It's like the med," and she said, "Do you really think I believe you? Does does this look cold?" No. Other people would say it's fucking freezing. The thing is, is um, it's when you get out, and you you get the wind on you. Then uh, there is a bit of a breeze today. But I've just ordered um, a dry robe, so when I get out, I get a big fluffy, fleecy, waterproof robe that I can chuck on. And as I, the year goes on, and I, I, I'll go in. What I'll do then? I'll bring a flask with me, so I get out. I can have a, a nice warm drink and stuff. 
Um, but now I'll get out, I'll dry off, I'll sit in the sun for a bit because it's a nice, nice sunny day. Sit in the sun, watch nature, um, and it it does sort the head. Yesterday, suicide prevention day, um, I did post a video. I put it up on YouTube. Uh, I did share it on Facebook, but like I said, I'll put them all all up on the website. If anyone ever wants to come and enjoy the benefits and the beauty of nature and cold water swimming, wild swimming, whatever you want to call it, give me a shout and we'll sort something out. Um, and as, as we speak, don't know if you'll be able to see, Mr. Heron just floating over. He's probably looking down here, he's thinking, that's a big fucking fish, I ain't gonna eat that. I don't think he'd fit me in his mouth. Anyway, people, enjoy your day. Have a good weekend. I'll be going home, cook the tinker of steak. Yes, Saturday, steak and mash. Me, water, I'm having um, a smoked cod loin with Pembrokeshire Earlies, butter gleeks, and a parsley sauce. Take care, people. Bye.